The following program contains disturbing images not suitable for children. What follows is the very last recording of MSNBC's program, To Catch a Predator, which you're about to see now may shock and alarm some viewers. Viewer discretion is advised. While many of the other men caught by our hidden cameras have delivered horrifying expectations and requests, they don't compare with what comes next. Seated in this parked hatchback is a predator in wait. A transcript of his online discussions under the alias Want Some Candy yielded a startling conversation. I can't wait to show it to you. Me either. How big is it? Why does that matter? It doesn't. It will split you open and leave pieces in the forest. Wow, that's hot. He went on to ask if she wanted to see a movie. When she suggested something like Lethal Weapon, he simply wrote, Danny Glover can suck it. LOL. Wearing some form of ritual garb and face mask, most likely a repeat offender trying to enter this suburban home where he believes he will find a 13-year-old girl. Here, our decoy invites him in where we plan to lay our trap. Oh, hey, come in. I'm going to go brush my teeth real quick, okay? See you right there. Hi. Have a seat. Right there. So, what are you doing here? Uh-huh. I don't seem to quite understand. Why don't you help me? I see you brought a bag with you. Can we see what you brought here today? Alcohol, some contraceptives, lubricant. Were you planning some type of, whoa, what do we have here? Sir, can you tell me what this is? You were going to use this on a 13-year-old girl. Oh, you were going to have her use this on you. I see. This is the part where I tell you that we've been recording this entire conversation. I'm Chris Hansen with Dateline MSNBC. We're going to bring in some cameras. Now you're free to go, but... The suspect went on to assault the officers outside using what can only be described as some kind of energy pulse device. By all accounts, he is considered still at large and should not be approached.